Uh, last time you were on, I, uh, I, I was just gushing about <laughs> Gilmore Girls and that it was coming back to, to Netflix. The that was amazing, though. I think you helped us get the word out. You loving the show. I really like... love the show so much. Yeah, I mean, so cool. you owe everything to me. Yeah, I mean, really, no. <laughs> you were just Not fantastic in that. Thank you. And, uh, and I think at the time I was binge watching. I was only <laughs> I was only up to season four of of Gilmore Girls, and yeah. whew, I made it all the way through, man. And, I mean, you're just fantastic, man. Thank you for making that, uh, uh, that, that thing. It, became, it was a giant success, so uh, I don't know. It was know. fun to do more. I, I couldn't believe we got to do that Do reunion. you have a favorite episode? Do, and it, I think it's the one, I, you know which one it is. You know which It has to be. Come on. Which, wait, I don't know which one you're thinking of. Yeah, you do. I do? Yeah, yep, the yep. The last one ever. No, no, kind of. Last four words, no. No, but that was great, too. I don't no. know. Which one are you thinking you know, of? And the whole town got together and... <laughs> Oh, what are you doing? Wait, which time? Which when? When, when you were you were leaving? Oh, that is a really nice episode. I was crying actually. my brains out. Yeah, it was fantastic. It's very emotional. Oh, it was fantastic. How could I forget that? That, that was... That's the one. That's you that's changed. That's the one. Yeah, you should tell everyone that's your favorite episode. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I can and go And then back uh, now. not to keep going by all the my favorite, your greatest hits for me, but <laughs> Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants. You know, I, I, that's my jam. That is my jam. I love you, and I love that movie. I love everyone in it. Uh, I love it too. I love the sequel. Is there? Can there be another one? I hope. I really hope so. I would love it. It would be the best thing. Do you thing. still talk to the other the other uh, guys? Yeah. I, I mean, we don't get to see each other a lot because everybody's work and family and everything. But um, when everybody's in town, we do, and we just pitched a third movie, and I hope it comes together. It would be so you great. You did for real? Yeah, we did. What? That's I big news. <laughs> you have to do that. Please I would do love it. it. I would love it. Oh, I love this so much. Uh, let's talk about uh, *Handmaid's Tale*. Okay. Man, oh man. <laughs> uh, well, that's. I mean, this is like this is some, some dark, crazy. It's really dark. It's really intense. It um, really is. Did you know that it was going to be like this? It was gigantic. It won every single award known to man. I mean, really, <laughs> including you, who won an Emmy. So congratulations yeah, well, on thank that. Thank you so much. Wow, we were out here for you. <laughs> thank you so much. No, there's no way to know. I, I guess you know what's going to you know, um, communicate with an audience what people are going to love. But um, I knew the script was great. We got the, you know, the scripts and um, they were so strong. The character was so oh, complex. Tricky, so tricky, I was like, this is tricky good. Tricky character. Oh, it's so tricky. It really is challenging. I mean, it's the most incredible challenge. I love it. But, um, but yeah, I have to gear up for work and really like, well, yeah, did you, you didn't think you were going to come back for season two, right? Or? I didn't know. Yeah, I was a guest star the first year and then um, just, you know, I heard that I might be back after the fourth episode um, wrapped up the first season, so I was... You have to come back. Everyone loves you. Yeah, you can't Thanks. leave. Yeah, yeah. I'm ex yeah, I was so excited. And great. Elizabeth is fantastic. Oh, she's I mean, so good, yep. The, the whole thing, if you... If, well, do, can you set it up, well, what people need to see for season two if they haven't? Because I, I could describe it, but I'm going to... Right, well, Elizabeth Moss's character offered and narrates the story, which basically entails a totalitarian regime taking over um, our government, and um, it's sort of in a society where um, people are having a hard time becoming pregnant, so uh, the fertile women are enslaved and forced to have children for the regime, essentially, so it's really brutal. It's, um, That's but... what I was going to say. Yeah, I was go. It it's, is... It's... It's, it's tough. Yeah, yeah. it's tough. All but right. but so enlightening, and and I think it really fosters a sense of empathy uh, for these characters and their you know human suffering. Essentially, it's it's Oof. it's you, it takes you it's on a well whole done. ride. It's well done. It's well done. and on and on. Ah, I said. And it's on and on and on.